Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning, guys. You guys going to be so proud of me. You guys are going to be so proud of me. First, I want to say thank you all. I want to say thank you all for your prayers. Thank you all for your prayers. I wanted to say this. I tried it. I done it. And I love it. On, uh, I want to say on last night, I was on a date with a woman. On a date with a woman. And I wanted to say this. That's the, I, let me, I'm not going to I'm not gonna get, get you all this. First, I want to say I am saved. But it was my first time ever touching a woman on her sides, sitting down at the dinner table, smiling, you know. So that was my first time ever touching a woman. I wanted to say this. I am very proud of myself. I'm not bashing no one. But I wanted to say, ladies, you got some strong flowers. God has paraded you to be a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful rose. Man, it is muddy. Take care of your women. Take care of your woman. Love on her. Treat her like she's a queen. I wanted to say to the men, I do. I would not. There is. I'm not doing this for no camera. I'm not doing this for no family. I'm not hiding behind closed doors. I respect what you do, but I want to say there is nothing I want to do to turn back. I do not want to go back. Why? I will not want to lay in a bed that, that another man got the same thing that I got. I want to lay. I want to lay in a bed, and I want to smell Chanel. And I do not want to smell the same cologne that we both got on. And we both got the same thing. No. God created Adam and Eve. And I am so happy that God has put in my heart as of today. I'm going to live for him. And I'm going to, I am going to follow his footsteps of being a strong black African America man. That's what I want to do. That's in my heart. I have no desires to come back. When I tell, let me tell you something. It really feels good to be what you are. To be a strong man. It feels good to be what you are. And I am thanking God that I can say to myself, my first time ever touching a woman. Ever touching a woman and I am very proud of myself you said well you should keep that a secret no you've been in my business now now I'm being real with you and the Lord spoke to me and said Andrew keep a deep voice work out follow the footsteps of how to be a strong African American male and that's what I'm going to do so hey guys lift me up in prayers because as I take this big decision as I take this big journey to live for Jesus because God created Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. So I am I am thanking God and I will present myself as a strong man, not as a weak, not as a pump, not as a fag. No, no, no. I'm not bashing no one, but I wanted to say this. Thank you all for your prayers. Thank you all for your prayers and his righteousness. Romans, and you know, I will never forget. He said, um, I will never forget about what um, <clears throat> people told me in the past that you can do it no matter what you are doing through Andrew you can do it he said that keep holding on and you know what you know what's to worry about I'm still standing I'm still standing after 2014 still standing still making people laugh still doing it but as of today I can stand in front of you guys and say I finally touched a first, my first female. I finally touch a first female. And when I say it felt good. <laughs> mm, like the camel noodle soup. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, good. <laughs> so I want to say to you guys thank you guys and stay you, you want you guys know my, my friends. I stay prayed up. 
they'll give me bow. I stay prayed up, they'll give us bow. So I want to say I'm going to work hard to keep this deep voice forever. I'm going to work hard to be a strong black African, African American man. And who cares they didn't call my name on yesterday? Hey, I still got many more things to do. I'm still standing. I still got more things to accomplish in life. I would say they have accomplished a lot of things in life. I had my I had my 15 minutes. I did what I supposed to do. I'm still standing now since 2014. But I can say this. They, uh, as I looked at them, when I'm glad they didn't call my name because it was not meant for me to call my name in that category. I'm not a queen. I'm a man. I'm not a queen. I'm a man. So thank you for not coming. Thank you for not. Thank you for not. Thank you for not mentioning my name in that category. I watched the wars yesterday. I saw all queens. I'm not mad, but I'm just saying thank you for not calling my name during that time because I want to present in my body a living sacrifice. I want to be a strong black man. And that's coming. So I wanted to say to you guys, I wanted to look, I wanted to say to everyone, as of today, as of last night, I finally touched touch a black woman. I finally my first time ever touch. I'm giving you guys my first experience. I, I touch a woman. And when I say I'm not going back. There is nothing in life that will make me tip and dip. There is nothing in life that will make me go and sleep around and then try to say I'm a man. No, I do not want to lay up in the. I would not want to lay up in the bed. We both got the same thing, because you know what? I had to realize, like you know, when I was doing that stuff, that stuff didn't feel good. That's one, and then and the, and the two, it, it 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 was not meant that stuff to be around me and to, to be in me. So the, the, let me tell you, let me tell you to all my men, to all the men that are trying to come out of this. Let me tell you something. Don't go by your family. Don't go by the public. A, a woman is going to accept who you are and who you are. They're going to accept. They go. They want to accept. They're going to have to accept it, or you move on. And they, God created millions of women out in this world. If the woman, if a woman, you sit down and say, "Let me be real with you. I slept with a man. I'm sorry, but it's my past. Can you forgive me? I promise you, I will not go back. If she will not accept you from your past, let me tell you something. Move on." Move on because if she's not going to accept you who you are, move on. Move on because as God created millions of women out here in this world, it's move on. Move on. But I come here to let you guys know I'm not asleep. I'm not tired. I don't need no 15 minutes. I'm just letting you know my first time of ever touching a woman on last night. And I'm very proud of myself. And I'm very, very proud of myself. And you say, well, where's your right? Why are you just going to keep that to a secret? Are you living safe? Yes, I'm living safe. But you've been in my business from the, you've been in my business from the beginning. And I'm going to let stand in front of you all by name here to let you know I finally dated a, with, with a woman. And it felt good. So... Hey, now it's time, it's time, it's time. Doom, 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 doom. Hey, we don't go, we ain't gonna talk about that right now. But hopefully, hey, hey, I feel good. I feel good. I feel really good just to be, and you know what? I believe people, I believe y'all gonna be proud. I believe the people that really support me and support people that really love me, they're gonna be really like, wow, Andrew, good job. Well, I'm just saying. I'm just saying, with somebody that been with a man that did that, that 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 did everything that woman dressed like a woman, talked like a woman, did the things like a woman. I mean, you got to at least give me some respect. My first time touching a woman did what I supposed to do, and now that I'm, I, I said, like I tell you, they're gonna sell you for who you are. If they, if they don't sell you, say, babe, hey, you on a date now? I take care of your meal. We having fun, okay? So I'm gonna tell you my parents. I used to date a man. I used to have sex. You got to be real with them. And that they say, no, no. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Finish eating a little steak. Finish eating your potatoes. And as soon as we get done, I'm going to move on and go to the next one. Oh. All you got to do is move on and go to the next one. I wanted to say to you, everyone. I wanted to say, everyone, I love you guys really, really, truly, truly from my heart. Thank you for making me be a strong man. Thank you. And, and I'm going to continue to work on my mannerism because only I can't wait. Let me tell you something. I can wait for God to do it. But if I'm trying and know God is in my heart and know God, the spirit of the Holy Ghost is on me, man, I'm going to walk like a man, talk like a man, be a man. Hey.
to go out and work this out there. Hallelujah. And that's the honest truth. Love you guys. Let me finish getting ready. Let me get ready. Let me get ready. And let me tell you guys something. You guys don't get nothing but the truth because if I don't tell the truth, let me tell you something. Shame of the devil. You guys can see it all on my face. And I don't want that on me. I don't want, you know, I love people too much to have to be around her lying and all that mess. No, I'm with a woman now and I'm proud to stand in front of you guys to say I'm a strong black African American light skinned with a woman now. Praise God. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, bye, God. And no more kisses. No more. Hey, good night, God. Look, good morning. Thank you, guys.